Thank you very much. This is a fantastic base. I'm going to miss this place. Uh, we don't need any of that. That's all stuff we can get up there. We don't need that. Batteries we don't need. There's nothing in the scanner room. Uh, let's see. I didn't have much stored here. I'll just grab some food. Shame I can't preserve the melons for the journey or something. That would be nice. We can take that. And I may as well take the salt. That's it. There's, we have nothing else here. I'll grab some more materials from out. Oh, hang on. Um, yeah, let's just go and set that scanner back off. Because there is one thing might be worth picking up. And that is um, a bit more nickel. Just in case. I think I, think I have enough on the Cyclops, but just in case. Mountain Blade was excellent. Um, I used to like Mountain Blade. Battle Brothers, a turn-based tactical RPG, a bit like... All right, okay. Well, maybe I should take a look at that then. But turn-based. Hmm. A little more sulfur. I'm hoping I might have enough sulfur. Uh, let's just go and get this ore that's showing up. I've probably got enough ore. Probably. You never know, do you? Unless I looked it up and checked the recipe before going back up, but I think... I think I'll be okay. I'll just fill this up. We'll go back in. And then uh, I'll turn the base on to scanning for sulfur, and if there's any sulfur on the way out, we'll grab it. If not, we'll just go. Because, um, yeah, I don't need the upgrades and stuff anymore. So I can deconstruct. What did I make? I deconstructed like a thermal generator or something that used a bit of sulfur. Let's go and see what we've got in the, uh, in the lockers. Metals. Chuck all that in there. Uh, not that. We've got one, two, three, four, um, ten ish, eleven nickel there. We've got an alien turd. Don't know what I'm going to use it for, but <laughs> you never know when it might come in handy. Oh, we've got more nickel there. Sulfur, you can see there's actually no sulfur down here. I think these are all empty, apart from that. I do have some sulfur up here. I'm sure I have some sulfur up here. Kyanite. Ah. Oh, I've got... That must be enough kyanite. Four sulfurs. Is that all the sulfur? I thought I had more than that. What's in the uh, storage in there? Two more. And some power cubes. Screw it, I don't know what I'm building. Let's go and actually just see where we get to, but I will. Just go and turn that scanner onto sulfur. It's the last job I'll do, I suspect. In my beautiful undersea base. I really do like this base, it looks fantastic. Let's do... Is there any in, in range, actually? Yes, there is. I, I, I suspect it's going to be, like, lower down, but... Um, on the off chance it isn't. Let's get the hell out of here. Back home. Maybe. If I can get past that last final... Horrible thing. Engine. Oh, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. Hang on, turn it back off. No. Off. Look at that. I forgot about those damn things. Right. How many of these damn limpet things have I got eating away at my hull? 
Don't even think about coming back. Any more? Yep. Oh, two over here. I have a horrible feeling that they will be stuck back on before I get fully away. Boom. Don't know if that connected or not. I'm going to miss the old Cyclops. I really enjoyed uh, playing around with this. Having said that, this, this might not be the end of the game. I, I may not have all the materials that I need to build the rocket, so. I can see them on, oh, can I see them on that? Excellent, cheers. Engine right. Powering up. Let's get the hell out of here. That'll do. Flank speed. <laughs> <laughs> just noise. crash straight into this thing. All that crystalline sulfur is below me, in levels below, so let's hope we've just got enough. Well, that didn't take long, did it? Thought I might have got a bit more flank speed out of that. I can see him on the hologram on the left. You mean like uh, in the on the wall of the cockpit? Right, I've got to try and think which is the quickest way out of this. I don't actually know. I have an entrance over there, which is a long way off. But I don't... Uh, that'll do. Let's just go for it. We might need a bit of sonar. Well, wherever we're going, it's uh, we're getting higher up. That's got to be a good sign. The one on the wall? Ah, cheers. Okay. You know some games that would not be good for streaming? Um, depends what you like. Frostpunk was good. Yeah, I enjoyed Frostpunk. That was, that was another great game. Stealth RPGs, roguelikes and similar. Oh, I'll tell you what I do have that I, uh, I'm i going to play. I'm going to play a complete back-to-back -back playthrough of um, Divinity Original Sin 1 and 2 on stream at some point. When I say back-to-back, -back, um, potentially interspersed with something else occasionally to, to break it up a bit. But... Um, hmm. This isn't the way I intended to go. Just a minute. I've got an entrance down there. Well, I hope that's the one that I want to go to. Uh, maybe a bit high up here. Uh, there's that, and there's I've got Pillars of Eternity 1. I've got that I can play through. Um, and lots of stuff, really. I, am I going back the way I just came from? It looks suspiciously like it. Doing it original sin two is great. Good. Um, yeah, those little bugs—they they just suck power. They don't do any hull damage, but um, power is. I should be. I should have enough power to get out of here. The head standard. I think I'm going to ignore my beacons and I'm just going to follow the rising um, seabed level. Also, I better just watch that. That sonar does drain quite a lot of power. I don't think I need to worry about this last Leviathan too much because I've got a decoy which could potentially just get rid of him quite quickly. I'm just going to sail down here and see where it brings me out. Observation? If you like sci-fi, it's a must-have. Short game, but the story's worth it. Then there's uh, Japanese visual novels. I don't think I'm into those. Yeah, I'm not into anime at all. There he is, look. It's low. <laughs> Has he found me? Well, let's put Silent Please running silent on. Running. 
He can, he can get screwed. I don't think he's ever been a problem to me, that fella. Flank speed! Flank. Emergency speed. Morning. Vessel counted. Excessive noise. Not for long, anyway. Uh, question for me in the chat. If this game was set in a shared universe with any other game or movie, which one would that be? Ooh, uh, I don't know. Um, I could see it taking place in the uh, Aliens or Predator universes. Um, I could kind of see that, but I don't know other than that. Are we going up here? We are... Is this a dead end? It's not a dead end. Slow. I hit slow. Crunch. Grind. Smash. Tis but a flesh wound. We're okay. Oh no, this is the right way out. I think I tried coming in some crazy way like this uh, at one point. It's amazing where you can actually drive a Cyclops. Universe sandbox. Avatar? Yeah, Avatar could kind of fit in. Alright, we found that base. Um, which is excellent. <laughs> um. Give me a way out of this. What sort of creature attack? I don't think it's a savage creature. It's not like a le leviathan or anything. Has he got hold of my tail, has it? I've got the tail hung up, I think. Is that thing attacking me again? Yeah, it's taking a bite out of me. We need to find a way to the surface, but I don't... Oh, hang on, there are some... Right, let's go up here. I think that's going to be too hard to actually get out, isn't it? Or is it? That might be doable there. Assuming that that is in fact a way out. It looks it, doesn't it? I'm still getting chewed on at the back. Maybe I should go out and shoot it with a stasis rifle. Um, yeah. Are we stuck? Are we stuck? Okay, that's not good. What is that thing that's, that's bugging me? I can't get down here. Give me a stasis rifle here. Um, yeah, better equip it. Oi, you, come here. Boom. Leave me alone. Actually, when you look at the size of the Cyclops, getting out of that hole is a bit optimistic, isn't it? Wow, he didn't stay uh, stasis for long. Now, quickly, 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 quickly. Five. Oh. Go away. Yeah, I might have to might have to rethink this exit strategy. You can charge that gun up. I haven't I haven't used the guns much at all. If I can steer there. Let's go forward. Let's go forward into that hole. Go on, just ram it forward. That's it, that's it, that's it. We're going out. We're away. <laughs> there you go, folks. 
If brute force doesn't work, you just simply weren't using enough. Now let's get the hell to the surface and go and build ourselves a rocket. 67% energy. I hit flank. Emergency speed. Warning. Vessel calculated. Excessive noise. Everything fits if you're willing to squeeze hard enough. Poor old Dave. Dave isn't going to stay around any longer. Dave the Sea Moth. Ah oh well, he did good service. Yeah, I've enjoyed my Cyclops. My Cyclops has been good. We're up. I think we surfaced a bit fast there. The gravity gun leaves some to desire. The gravity gun... Yeah... It's a shame you can't... I mean, there's different torpedoes you can load into this, isn't there? I've just got a decoy loaded, which I've never used. Um, but it would be nice to have got something which could, like, launch some, like, immense measure of pain into something's face. I think I would have liked that. <clears throat> Still, I mean, for someone who crash-landed in a metal pod on a planet, we haven't done bad. We've built two underwater homes and a nuclear submarine, so... Oh, sorry, an electric submarine. How far off are we? I want to be close enough range that I can easily transport the materials. We're into shallow waters here, which is the nuisance factor. <laughs> Of course, it doesn't matter. We're not taking this with us. A few scratches. Doesn't really matter anymore, does it? I can always take the power cells out of this as well, can I? The ion cells, if I need them for the rocket. How do you, how do you boost a rocket with battery power? How does that work? Hopefully that doesn't. 300 meters. Can I park this any closer? There's my rocket platform. I think I can pull in a little bit here. Get a bit closer. You like how you're not really supposed to fight the creatures? I thought the creatures would be a lot more dangerous. Uh, maybe I've got away lucky. But I thought... Um, like, I mean, they are dangerous. But, I mean, they, they seem reasonably easy to avoid if you put in, like, a little bit of effort into it. Like, that sea dragon thing, I, I thought that was going to be absolutely terrifying. And, um, it, it wasn't nearly as hard or as scary as I expected. Stop! Engine powering down. Okay. Let's see what I need for the next stage of this rocket. Um, uh, Neptune boosters. I need a plasteel ingot, two aerogel, a wiring kit, and three nickel ore. So let's go and get the. I should have this downstairs. Metals. Two silver for the wiring kit. One, two, three for those. It's going to be. Oh, lithium's going to be the problem, actually, isn't it? Let me put these in here that I don't need. I don't need all that. Three, four. Hang on. I'm just chucking stuff in here that I don't need at the moment. We should be done with laser cutters, repair tools, flares. We're done with we're done with an orange tablet. When did I did I not need to use that for something? Um let's go and get that started crafting. You feel like once you know how the creatures work, they're easy to avoid? Yeah, for the most part. I, I still don't understand how we avoided that sea dragon on the way out. I was, I was convinced that was going to be the thing that did for me. I thought, great, we've got in, we've done all the base research and everything. And I thought, I bet that's the problem when I try and escape. So all I need is a crap ton of this stuff now. Uh, let's go and 
find some scrap. There should be loads of it kicking about in the seabed. There might be loads of it in my old base. I didn't take everything out of there, as I recall. Welcome aboard, Captain. Come on, just go up the ladder. I didn't actually think about um, uh, wreck. I don't want to wreck. Metal salvage. Get scanning for that. Sea dragon swims in a big circle. You got lucky. He was right there when I was going in. He was always on top of us, which was it did. I did feel the pressure a little bit, uh, which was cool. We've got we've got no titanium. We've emptied the titanium out of here, I think. I guess we took all the good stuff, uh, nearly all the good stuff for base building. Um, interesting. Okay. Let's go and find something. There'll be um, plenty of scrap on the seabed anyway. Three of these and I should be done. One. Advantages of the scanner, eh? Never really used it much till the, till the late game. I exited through a different hole. I might, might have. I might have come sneaking out of a different hole. Three. Okay, back to the base. <laughs> I really love that submarine. I didn't like it at first. I felt it was too slow, but I've come to really love the Cyclops. Um, what's in my? Uh... Huh, just wonder what was left in there. They haven't bred very much, them things, have they? I thought the crash fish might have bred a bit more. TJ Cat, thanks for the follow. Uh, what are we doing? We're making a plasteel ingot, aren't we? Get it bit by bit. There are things in the game I didn't find? Oh, no, that's, that's, that's fine. I know there's a... Uh, well, looking at where them teleporters brought me out... I found at least one alien um, stash or power base or, or sub base or something. Not an alien base, but like an alien... It was like some sort of construction in the caves underwater. Um, I did stumble into one of those. After, you know, I was coming out through the teleporters at the end. Uh, so there's, there's clearly more of those lurking about. Did I not bring lithium with me? I could have sworn I brought lithium with me. I guess I didn't then. It's back to the sub. I can always deconstruct my furniture. I can. If I need parts desperately, I can take things take things apart. I think I know what I did. I think I put it in here. I certainly have two lithium in here ready to go. So we get the plasteel ingot. I think I've got everything for the next stage of the rocket here. No, I never did see the, the, the flooded moon pool. I don't know what happened with that. I'm going to take your guys' words for it, because um, I just didn't see it. Two aerogel. I might have some in my parts locker, because I did bring some of that with me. I have not, but I have enough air sacs, gel sacs up here. Back in the base. Back in the base we go. It looks like I'm getting low. Oh, I might be getting low on these things, actually. I'll just plant some more emergency ones. Three is probably too many. Oh, bollocks, I've put some back in. <laughs> Them two. It's still flooded. Are we talking about the... Which moon pool are we talking about? This one, I thought you were talking about the one back at the other base. Oh, I see what you mean. I thought you were referring to the, the one at the other base downstairs. 
That is like a... That is some glitch. Yes, I can see that now. Weird. There's nothing to repair. It seems to be in perfect working order. <laughs> I guess we lost air pressure in there. Yeah, my mistake. I thought you were talking about the, the other moon pool being flooded. Um, so, oh, hang on. Here we go. I need rubies for this. Please tell me I've got some in the Cyclops. Because they could be uh, a little while to harvest. I don't remember having to build a lot of things with rubies. Precious. There we go. Pays to be prepared. Is it true that the dog's bollocks means something is awesome and nothing like... Uh, yes, that's exactly what it means. It, it does mean something's awesome. You wouldn't think so, but yes, that's, that's what it means. I don't know where the phrase comes from, actually. I don't know why dog's bollocks are particularly associated with awesomeness. Or the cat's pyjamas, or the bee's knees. I don't know. None of it, none of it makes a whole lot of sense. Right then. Give me my rocket platform. Where did I put it? There we go. God, this is a long way away. Yeah, the dog's bollocks. What salesman thought that one up? That's English for you, not the smartest of languages. I can't, I can't disagree with that. Okay, let's see if we can build... I don't know where we build this one from, actually. A little bit of light out here would be nice. We want the Neptune boosters. I wonder if I need to, like, uh, stack it with provisions for the trip. What am I laughing at? What are you guys laughing at? What have I missed? Ice Wallopis. Hi, how's it going? Um, Kyanite. Two power cells. And the plasteel ingot again. Okay, so I've... Ooh, four crystalline sulfur. I think I just have enough for that. Where's my... Uh, it's over there. How is that growing... Glowing green? Is that... Um, uh, okay. Just the lights off that uh, those seeds that I've got. Oh, we need some more metal salvage on the way in, don't we? Another two should be enough. I can see me running out of lithium doing this trick, actually. Oh, and thanks for the follow. Cheers, Ice. Thanks for the follow. We ran out of drink. Can't be bothered to get up for a new one. Oh. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, that's exactly what I was doing. It is too much effort to walk to the kitchen to uh, to get some additional water. Normally, when I've played other games, I've come in with like two pint glasses full of water um, to last me through a stream. But for whatever reason, when I've been playing some Nautica, I've not even been finishing one, and I don't know why that is. So, uh, yeah, tonight I, I made the wrong choice. It is, it's too far. If, if I get up to walk away, then who knows what will happen. The game will crash and the, uh, the world will end. <laughs> Fed up with all that water around you. I will be glad to... Well, no, I don't know if I will be glad to get off it. I feel like I've seen as much as I want to see um, in the game, which is... Which is good. I feel like I've given it a good run and really enjoyed it. And... 
We'll play it through again when I've completely forgotten where everything is and how it all works. That's the plan. So I need two of those. There was a delay. There was a definite delay then. I thought, it's crashed. I need another two of those. And what else is in my list of goodies? 